I am Katie Hillier and I'm the creative director of Mark by Mark. And I'm Luella and I am designing the clothes for Mark by Mark. She's the design director for Ready to Wear. The <laughs> design type. director. <laughs> so we started out just kind of thinking about the girl and what we loved about the Mark by Mark girl that already exists and who she's become from when she was born 13 years ago and I felt that she needed to get some attitude back. You know, I started with thousands of pictures and mood boards and, and, and the girl who's kind of there in a package and, and so I get the character very quickly but that's my sort of my difference in the way I design. It's much more about storytelling than a silhouette. We've seen about 70 girls, pretty girls. <laughs> Well, it was very important for me to find a character within the casting. And for me, when I see a girl, it's about their energy just as much as what they look like. This time we're trying to create individual characters with each of the outfits, so it's probably going to take a little bit longer. Where it starts to get a bit tricky is when you start having to put outfits to the girls that you think are going to work, and then when they start coming in for their fittings, that's when you have to build the character. What should we do about the polar neck? Maybe we should make them. Turtle neck? And we have all... Oh, I'm sorry. We call them... <laughs> we call them polo neck. Chimney neck. Chimney, chimney neck. Is that the chimney? Like yes. the, the I don't say chimney. I say chimney. Chimney? With an L. Chimney? I don't know where... With I the fireplace? Right. Okay, so let's get back on track. You know, there's quite a lot going on up top and a lot with the clothing and I think you needed something big and strong on the foot. They just, um, they went for it and put as much <coughs> crazy technology and, you know, used all of their new techniques on these shoes. The set's done. They're building it. KCD have just finishing. I have to turn this off. Sorry. <laughs> There's upside down skate ramps and there's half pipes and that kind of thing, but they're organised in a way that doesn't look literal. So we wanted to try to think about a more epic soundtrack. So we, we changed gear a little bit and we started looking at more cinematic kind of soundtracks that we could mix together to create a score for the show. Oh, it's really good and odd. <laughs> You know, it's I want people to go to that show and go, you know, just have a, a strong feeling about it. You know, it's, it's that kind of, you, you're sort of, you're hit with that attitude quite quickly. You know, yeah. it's fairly obvious who she is, I think. This doesn't feel like it's happening. This feels so unreal to me. 